Hello and welcome back. Hello to you and to everyone. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day as we continue fighting for the Empire, for Edelgard. We have a lot of dialogues to do and we're gonna do them right after one battle. I don't want to start the stream off with jank like that. Okay, this one is easy. Easy clap. More damage, more speed. Quicker, faster. Ah, uh, bullocks. Uh, Edel Guards here. We got. We're bringing. You don't Bernie. Me to go out there and fight, do you? Uh, other than that, I think we're fine, right? Well, we'll see. Let's earn our keep. As long as I reach 500 kills within seven minutes, we're fine. I think I'm just gonna switch them and then try and smash as much. Leave this to me. Not a problem. I've got watch this. So Bernie. Well, I promise to save you. We will surmount this challenge together. My apologies. But we require immediate support. I wonder if they also take more damage. Our friendos. That would not be incredibly nonsensical. Okay, that was a little bit too fast. It is already in trouble, though. It's no use. We can't gain any ground. Wait, it's I... Wait where the f? Here I Edel go. Guards? No mistakes. Oh, I went into the wrong direction. Oops. Jordi and Ferdy are already heading that way, that's good. I'm sorry, I made a mistake. Honking. We're not losing to anyone. Okay. How many? Oh, we're already there. Thank Jesus. Uh oh. Um. Here I go. No mistakes. Not a problem. I've got this. There's not a question of can. Leave this to me. Alter to the one. And watch for an opportunity to strike back. Hiko has arrived. How are you today, Hiko? Doing it right? Maybe? 
You're gonna leave me in the dust if I'm not careful. <laughs> See fists, axe, and book, and lightning. This guy is dead yet? Here I go. No. Bit tired after work and needing to walk across town to pick up shoes. Wait, didn't deliver? Didn't it didn't get delivered to your house? Well, this on Saturday when I was at work. Cringe. Town. God damn it. So, what do you think? Hubert definitely needs more defense. Bunch of bastards. Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. Let me know if I may be of further service. Let me know if I may be of further Supplies service. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. <sighs> Whoa. Another high level bow. And another one. Everything has its use. Does that mean I can give all my archers a over 100 bow? I remember who all my archers are. This one? Almost. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Um, city master. Allow me to assist with any matters. <clears throat> Recreation. Luxurious furnishing. And then thirty in total of these. 
And 30 in total of those. Let me know if I may be of further service. I'm getting there slowly. Supplies Maxing out the camp. The army. Um, this one, which is 16. Can't use Everything them yet right now. Use. At least not all of them. Allow me to assist with any matter regarding the facilities. Let me know if I may be of further service. Let me know if I may be of further service. Whew. Okay, talk to everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk to Ferdy. Hmm. Perhaps I will ask Edelgard to handle this matter. As for this one, it seems as though I have no choice but to do it myself. Uh, if only I could spare the time. Hey, Ferdinand. Uh, you should probably think about getting some sleep. That's an order, actually, from Hubert. But I agree with him. My apologies. My list of responsibilities has grown rather unwieldy of late. Exhausted as I may be, I will be done here shortly. You need not fret. Ferdinand, come on. I thought you were supposed to be giving everything your all. If you're really that tired, how are you going to be in any shape for what's coming tomorrow? Go on and give your all to a good night's sleep. Ah. <sighs> Yes, you are right. How could I, of all people, not realize the error in my ways? I shall take that to heart. Glad to hear you're coming around. Oh, and uh, finish fast, okay? Here, I'll even help. I don't want to go to bed just to find out you stayed up all night working. Let me just... Wait. Hmm? Uh... Never mind. Thank you for the concern. I will be sure to convey my gratitude to Hubert later as well. Don't forget. He's really worried about you, you know. Is he now? Usually he finds any occasion to criticize me. <laughs> Same here. <laughs> Is that so? And here I thought he had taken a shine to you. If he has, he sure doesn't show it. Before I forget, what would you think about coordinating our schedules tomorrow? I've been so absorbed in my work of late, we've scarcely had the chance to spend time together. I have been pouring all of my effort into rising early, training, eating, and in the process, I have neglected our friendship. As fellow advocates of giving one's all to all of life's pursuits, I say we work together to draw out each other's dormant potential. Works for me. My schedule's pretty light these days. It'll be good to spend some time together, but just so we're clear, we are not on the same page with this whole giving our all thing. Splendid! This should serve as all the motivation I need to continue pressing onward undaunted. And with that settled, I believe it is time for us to devote ourselves fully to a tranquil slumber. Come. Our lump-riddled camp beds await our zealous efforts. Okay, this time you are joking, right? It's seriously impossible to tell with you sometimes. Ferdinand. You're a lifesaver, Mercedes. Could you help me tend to this soldier's wounds next? Lady Mercedes, where would you like me to put this? Oh, um, yes, just a moment, please. You really have your hands full, Mercedes. Anything I can pitch in on? Oh, c 
goodness. I appreciate your offer, but I couldn't possibly ask you to take time out of your day to assist me in these tasks. Hey, don't be like that. Anyone who's still got the legs to stand on after a battle needs to do whatever they can to help. I'm no physician, but I can at least help get some of this stuff organized. But you only just returned from combat yourself. Aren't you exhausted? Ah, man. We are the Lubu. Hey, I could turn that question right back on you. You were there fighting with us that whole time. I suppose that's true. But are you sure you don't mind lending a hand? Nope. Sure as anything. Just tell me what to do and I'll be on it before you can even blink. In that case, there's a box over at the training grounds. Would you mind getting it? There should be bandages and medicine inside, so you'll be able to tell which one it is just by opening the lid. Got it. Be right back. Hmm? Oh my! Wait just a minute! What's up? Give me your right hand. My, uh, day okay. was okay. So far. Went to the gym, my back no longer hurts. Here, I can patch this up in a jiffy with my uh, magic. Did some Yakuza 4 completionist well, stuff. It's all better. Thanks, Mercedes. You need to speak Got groceries, made hurt, dinner. Right? Don't be so nonchalant about your health. Hey, I could say the same thing about actually never mind. Anyway, it should be easier to carry that box now. Thanks again, Mercedes. Other than that, not much. <laughs> Relaxing. Thank you for offering to help. Oh, and take all the time you need. There's no rush. So you know, just the dits and dats and doots and dots. Tough fight, eh, Lawrence? I'm just glad we both made it back safe. Indeed. Without your help, I surely would have met a noble warrior's demise. Thankfully, my admirers will have no reason to weep today. And for that, you have my gratitude. Well, that took a weird turn. Do you remember what I said before about the order of things in Fodlum? Totally forgot. <laughs> yeah, wasn't it something like, you nobles are here to protect us commoners, so we all should just be good little kids and go take a nap or something? <laughs> well, I don't recall saying anything about naps, but yes, we nobles have an obligation to protect the common folk. However, were a commoner to take a lethal strike in a noble's stead, then we have failed he said in our duty. Peasants wrong. I was dangerously close to suffering that fate myself. No, no, he said peasants in the okay, correct way. <laughs> you would have died if I hadn't saved you. And in doing so, you put yourself in a most precarious position. Your life could have been forfeit. Risking my neck to save others is just what I do. Yes, well, you were lucky to keep it unsevered this time. Mark my words, there is no reason a commoner should ever put their life on the line for a noble. Oh, I'm Could so noble! Your status, <laughs> sacrificing their life for the sake of my own. So do not do that again. Are we clear? You're right. I'm sorry. Do not mistake me. There's nothing for you to apologize for. Do I seem so selfish that I would make the person who saved my life then seek my forgiveness? All right, all right. No apology then. Sheesh. You're a real piece of work, you know that? Me? How rude. I will have you know I'm quite serious about this matter. Well, I hate to break it to you, but we can end up in that situation a hundred times, and I'll save you every single one. Astonishing. You fail to understand me after all this. Nah, I get what you're going for, but I've got my own way of doing things. 
Mercenary or no, I know there's nothing worse than watching an ally die right in front of me. Especially if they're weaker than me. I just can't help but jump in to save them, you know? Weaker? You cannot possibly mean me! I wonder if my joystick hey, will still crash my PC. If you don't want Good question. In to save you, then you've just got to get stronger. I must admit, your argument is sound. I cannot refute it. In that case, I ask you keep your eyes on me from this day forth. I shall endeavor to improve myself. The day my strength surpasses yours, my noble personage will save your commoner skin and restore the proper order to this world. <laughs> yes, this is uh, all Lorenz. the problems. <laughs> this is why nobody believes me when I say he's actually a decent guy. <laughs> uh. See. I like these conversations in of, of the characters, right? And getting to know the characters. I like these. Yeah, I was just But I also just want to play the game. Figure I'll probably run into some similar situations. That's admirable of you. I thought that someone with a mercenary background would be a little more reckless with their fighting. Oh wait, I'm sorry. That sounded a bit rude, didn't it? No, you're right. My fighting style was pretty loose when I was a mercenary. Actually, I can't say it's really changed that much. But I've got more responsibility now, so I've had to adjust some. Any mistakes I make would only cause problems for everyone else, right? Huh. You're much more studious than I thought. I can see why Edelgard trusts you so much. You really think I'm held in such high regard? That's what I've heard, at least. It's very impressive, especially since you're so young. Thanks, Lysithia. And the same goes for you, too. For a kid, you're amazing. Say she's a kid. Excuse me? Who's a kid? Who's a kid? Huh? Well, you are. I must ask that you refrain from treating me like a child. Uh, I wasn't trying to... You said, and I quote, For, a, for kid. a kid. I'm aware that people often treat me like a child, but to think you'd call me one directly to Into my face. my face! face. I work harder and contribute more to this army than anyone else here. It is truly vexing that something as inconsequential as my age can dictate how people treat me. Uh, I'm sorry. I had no idea you hated being treated like a kid that much. <sighs> this is not a matter of like or dislike. My belief is that those who fight alongside each other should treat one another as equals. Well, yeah. I, I thought I was complimenting you as an equal, obviously. Then there is no need for any qualifying language. You should compliment me as you would anyone else. Hold on. Didn't you tell me I was impressive for being so young? Doesn't that mean you assessed me based on my age too? <laughs> me saying you're impressive in spite of your age is completely different than you saying I'm pretty good for a weak little baby. Pretty sure I didn't phrase it like that. But it's what you meant! Oh, I should have never complimented you! You know, an adult wouldn't get all stubborn and combative like this. <laughs> I am not being combative. I'm simply having a normal conversation with you. Is that a problem? No, you're not. What about this is normal to you? <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> I like Listea, she's funny. <laughs> hey Marianne, you were really doing great during those drills today. Oh, uh, Something as inconsequential as my I'm age. Over to the mess hall. Uh, yeah, that, but... This morning and no break. I'm starving. 
That was definitely um, inconsequential oh, sorry during that time. You like to eat alone, right? Then don't worry about it. I'll find someone else. No, I'd I'd like to accompany you, if you would have me. That is. You sure? Well, all right then. Let's go. I wonder what's on the menu today. Oh man, that was good. I feel alive again. Yes, that was nice. By the way, why do you decide to come along with me? What do you mean? You usually sit by yourself. I thought you didn't like eating with others. Yes, I do feel more comfortable when I'm alone. I have just been very shy. Much. So I don't normally know what to say in conversations. Well, now I'm even more curious why you decided to eat with me. Well... You have a strange power, right? It makes you transform, or something like that. Yeah. You... curious about it? It's not so much that. I, am um, Wondered if you despised having it. Nah, I don't even give it much thought. And besides, my powers come in handy a few times. I know it makes people suspicious of me and curious about my background, but that's just how people are. And yet you always have such a sunny disposition, and everyone here respects you. I wondered why that was. I mean, I sure hope they respect me. So that's why you wanted to join me? I wanted to know how I could be like you. Like me? But, Marianne, it's not like you have some mysterious power tucked away, right? No, I, I... Don't. She has. If you just want to make friends with people, then you don't need to think so hard about it. It's not like anyone here hates you. Don't they? I'm so useless. Hey, you're a huge help to all of us. I mean that. So you don't have to. Is she a secret hentai monster? When you're not. If okay. only. I actually don't know. I don't think I've ever like uh, completed her socials in the previous game. So Marianne's uh, backstory is kind of eludes me. Still, I don't know much about her. She's also from a different class. It's also possible that I actually never recruited her. <sighs> uh, Yuritsa? What's wrong? Not here, either. Here, either. Hey, hold on. If you're looking for someone, I'd be more than glad to help. Uh, leave me be. Leave me be. Friendly as ever, I see. You know, it's kind of hard to believe you and Mercedes are related. Why don't you let me help you? You seem worried. How could you tell? You're not exactly hiding it. You nearly busted the chapel door clear off its hinges. Hmm. I'm looking for someone. She is injured. Huh? Did someone go missing from the infirmary? Wait, are you talking about an enemy? Not an enemy. However, she fled when she saw me. Well then, why would she run? Oh, I get it. Was it Bernadetta? Not her. Though, the one I seek was likely frightened by me as well. So he's a very frightening well, person. You're not really the most approachable guy. There's kind of this murdery aura about you. I like it. If I let way. my guard down for even a second, I want to be the last thing I ever do. Or be murdered. That is not my intention. No. <laughs> Wait, what? If I let my guard down for even a second, I 
it'd be the last thing I ever do. <laughs> I know that, but you probably still scare the life out of someone who's already jumpy. Even a beast would turn tail and run if it caught sight of the Death Knight. Then, what would you suggest? I will never capture her at this rate. Don't worth capture for one thing. Why don't you just let me help you? You know, strength and numbers and all that. She wouldn't be able to get away if there are two of us out looking. It is vexing when she flees, yes. But this matter does not require assistance. Yeah, I don't know. Is wasting. I must go. Wait, Yuritsa! Huh. Is, is he, he really, really gonna, gonna be okay? okay? <clears throat> but yeah, I had to... The Steas... Support dialogue with Marina was also about her having a mysterious power that she doesn't want to talk about. Mm. Mm. You're in better spirits than I expected. You look at least two shades less pale than you did after the battle at Fort Mercius. <laughs> oh, but your majesty does enjoy telling it like it is. Would it be the end of you to show a little compassion? <sighs> no. Then you would just be pitying me. I do not know which is worse. Regardless, I am well. Thank you for noticing. Ask of me what you will. And I shall see it done. I don't need anything from you, Ferdinand. Or at least not in that way. Just give me your usual effort. And that should be enough to get us through the upcoming battle. You can count on me. Point me at a foe. And I will dispatch them with all haste. I cannot afford to die now. Or my page in the history books will end in a most horrid fashion. Plagued by the guilt of striking down his father, Ferdinand welcomed the cold embrace of death on the battlefield. Some well, such hogwash. Yes, I killed my father, and I would be a liar if I said it did not wound me nearly beyond reckoning. But I will not hate myself for it. It was the correct choice. I did the right thing. Well, don't feel too bad. Imagine what they would write about me if we lose this war. Despite her futile attempts to wrest power from the Prime Minister, the Emperor's people turned against her and her life ended in abject failure. The end. <laughs> I know exactly what the world would say of me, which is why I have no intention of losing. I will not permit such a thing to happen. If ever my life were to be weighed against yours, I would gladly perish in ignominy if it meant keeping you alive and well. <laughs> what? Did I say something amusing? No, it's just... You're so strong, so proud. If oh. all the world's nobles were like you, there would be no need to dismantle the aristocracy. That's all. I know it's a futile thought. Nothing is futile. Though even I must admit it seems to be so, given the circumstances. Still, you vastly underestimate the potential of the aristocracy. For generations, our ancestors worked hand in hand, sharing knowledge and wisdom to administer our great land and ensure it was well protected. They acquired knowledge of the region and developed good policies to rule it. And in doing so, they earned the trust of the people. We cannot throw away everything they have built. It would be folly. Of course not. What do you take me for? I'm dismantling the aristocracy, not their legacy. The common folk will take up the torch and carry on. Do you believe they are ready? 
No matter how gifted they may be, they are only commoners. In order to replace the nobility, they need to be educated. Wait a moment. I see your plan now. You intend to establish a school. One that is not merely for nobles and wealthy merchant children, uh, like the Officer's Academy once was. A school where anyone can enroll, regardless of wealth or standing, and get an education rivaling that of any noble. Ferdinand? I cannot begin to guess where that idea sprung from, but this is exactly why I need you beside me as we shape the future of Adrestia. You mean to say that you did not actually... So I was... Well, well it's nice to be nice needed. To be needed. <laughs> uh, she hadn't even thought about that yet. Will the capital be all right? If another imposter... Hmm? Who's there? Who's there? Lady Edelgard? Is that you? Bernadetta? What are you doing here at this hour? Oh! Well, I was maybe sort of hoping to hole up here for a while. This is one of my go-to spots when I want to be alone. In that case, I apologize for intruding. Oh, it's really not a big deal or anything. Um... Lady Edelgard, is everything all right? You seem, well, kind of down. Give me strength! I'd be happy to listen. If you don't mind talking to me, I mean. Thank you, but I wouldn't know where to begin. Once the Emperor starts rattling off her many woes, you're likely to be trapped here forever. Um, actually, that isn't what I meant. Then, what did you mean? Do you remember that time you told me how my curse was lifted? And then you started to say that yours was too? Well, I've been worried that curse has been eating away at you the way mine did with me. Is that why you're here all alone in the middle of the night? Ugh. <sighs> I wasn't expecting you to see right through me quite so easily. <laughs> but you're right. Something is eating at me. There is an enemy I thought I'd fought and beaten, which I believed freed me from my curse. Alas, that was wishful thinking. My enemy is still alive. And worse yet, he Wait, is Wait, Hiko, are you eating Edelgards? <laughs> that sounds terrible. But I know how that feels. I've been struggling, too. If I stay outside too long, I end up being seized by this I gladly do. panic that makes me want to hide away again. She's hot. <laughs> I guess I'm still learning how to deal Edelgard with Edelgard most likely would step on you first, though. That's how life is, Bernadetta. We all bear our scars, but the only thing we can do is keep going. The idea that nestling up to someone and being kind will make all of their pain disappear? Is nothing more than fantasy. Also That's true. Not how such things work. Maybe I'm into it's that. A mean whole world. <laughs> that's for sure. But that's no reason to despair. <laughs> yes, all, mistress. I'm a pervert. A in which something like that. No longer left with scars like yours and mine. A world in which the people who wish to stand out can do so. While those who remain on the sidelines have their choice honored as well. That is the future we're building together. Do you really think we can do it? Because if you do, I'm going to fight right alongside you and then celebrate by locking myself in my room. Celebrate by locking myself <laughs> so long as you've taken right care back of into the my things room. you need to do. But doing things is the hard part! Stop being so difficult, world!
Seriously, if these conversations, like, didn't take up most of the fucking game... <laughs> I'd enjoy this game a lot more. L like, I don't hate the dialogue conversations because they're fun, but... So much... Be a little off here, so much information. The is more like this. No kidding. Well, so then this part here would actually mean something like... Hey, are this and this the same? I think they connect to that one thing from before. Nice one. So now you understand that part, right? Whew. I really made some progress today. Yes, you've been doing quite well. You used to only train your body, but lately you've been spending more time on your mind. Kinda got a better opinion of me now, huh? I mean, no way did I become a genius in just five days, but this still isn't bad. You've been hitting the books a lot yourself lately. Wouldn't you rather be out on dates or something? Not at all. I'm working very hard for the sake of our future. Also, studying together like this is sort of fun. I get it. It's kinda like training. The more you do, the more you get out of it. But I also noticed that my training has gone better since I started this whole studying thing. Um, <clears throat> and perhaps having a partner is helping too? <laughs> Still, it makes me kind of sad. We'd probably be studying together like this a lot more if the Academy hadn't shut down. I don't know about that. I mean, if we hadn't ended up in this war... Would I have found a reason to study like this? Honestly, I kind of doubt it. Kaspar, whatever's bothering you, you're not going to solve it by muttering to yourself. Yeah, you caught me. Yeah, you caught me. Up until Edelgard decided she was going to fight, I didn't know much of anything. Not about the evil guys who came into the Empire. A lot of studying. <laughs> Oh, did you have to go and make it dirty there, bro? <laughs> did you really? <laughs> Seeing you now is like looking at an adorable baby brother. I just want to pinch your cheeks and cheer you on with everything I've got. Uh, okay. I mean, sure, I'm the second son and you're older than me, but... Perfect. Then go ahead and start thinking of me as your big sister. You know what? I actually don't mind that. Big sis oh, Dorothea. Watching me grow, big sis. <laughs> I thought you'd just laugh that off. With the passing of five sunrises and five sunsets, even a boy can burgeon into an impressive man. Ah, uh, what? Is that another part of Francis's story? Oh, that's my little secret. <laughs> Still. Whatever am I to do now? Let's just continue bringing the best out of each other, for the sake of our post-war future. Our they are not family. actual brother and sister, okay? Never Different mind. families. Dorothea is a noble. Together, no Alabama. No Alabama. Yeah, we get to continue battles! Yeah! Party! <laughs> uh. Just normal incest roll. God damn it. Uh. Zoltan's bow. Nice. What at all is normal about that? <laughs> Defeat 500 enemies. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Oh yeah.
Okay, I think that's fine. Let's earn our keep. It looks like the problem. Not a problem. I've got this. I'm on it. No, just leave it to me. It's Bernie's time to shine. The fight's starting. It's Bernie's time to shine. Sure hope this goes okay. There is not a question of can. Only a matter of will. Leak. Come on, Bernie. You can do this. No messing around if we want to win. No messing around if we want to win. Job bought this. Taste more bitter than blackest coffee. Yeah, let's keep it going. You may continue to rely on me. Ugh. Why is my nose so fucking itchy today? This is what comes from one who shares my belief in giving you all. We'll get it done no matter what. Ada, Ada. So this is defeat. I'm sorry. Tell me somebody saw that. I saw nothing. I'm sorry. We weren't strong enough. Defeated the 500 enemies. Wyvern Lords. That is one for Bernie's. Let 
feel my thunder. And fuck do these mortal serpents suddenly come from? Seven servants, whatever, something. Are you sure? Smack that. All on the floor, smack that. Give me some more, smack that. Till you get sore, smack that. The bow of Sultan. I won't let. That's a nice bow. Three forge usage. Ooh, that's nice. Uh, two units to select to raise morale. Indeed. If you would. Summon alliance wyverns. Zoltan X as well. Kingdom force is marching into Daphnel territory from Galathea. Hold the front lines. Stronghold is captured. Okay, this should be fine. Easy. The fight starts now. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. It's Bernie's time to shot. Sure hope this goes okay. There's not a question of can. Leave this to me. I'm on it. No charge. Just be hungry to survive in battle. Do you not agree? No messing around. We want to win. Seize enemy strongholds without losing your own. Okay. And let's see, swords and okay. Just need to send you and these guys. Where did this sniper come from? Bandits have appeared. Don't mind if I do. Come here, Mr. Bandit.
Sorry. Sniper. Wounds are severe. I have to fall back. Let's keep it going. Bend these nuts. Now I'm confused. Not a problem. I've got already the strongholds ours. Time two minutes of the seven. Can you even bend nuts? If you try hard enough, probably. If you try hard enough. Sounds very painful. I do hope you'll make this fun for me. Rolling, rolling down the river, rolling down. Not a problem. I've got this. It's Bernie's time to shine. Sure hope this goes okay. I'm on it. Just leave it to. Not a problem. I've... Let's move out. <laughs> I can't believe that works. This victory moves us closer to great things. Ferdinand level up. Arrow of Indra.
I wonder if there is a Crested Spear for Ferdinand. Ferdinando. Fist magic, electricity, sword, axe, bow, and ice. You only have two slots and you have four. So we got. We're taking Edelgard. For the axe, fists we got, and we need someone that can use electricity. Just Dorothea, a little bit low level, but that's okay in this case. And in the meantime, most likely solo your with Yordi, the other one. Oh, okay. Let's earn our keep. Seems easy enough. Time for the Here I go. No mistake. They must learn who they're up against. I'm on it. No charge. Just 48, leave three levels leave lower than Dorothea me. should be fine. That's the pain parade. Here goes. United, we are unbeatable. Shh, don't tell them. They need to think that United, we are beatable. Time we're just gonna let Yordi do some slapping around everywhere. We're on 50, we still need 150 more KOs. today how was your monday
Oh yeah, guys, I turned uh, the encounter thing off. This is Fire Emblem Warriors, not the actual Fire Emblem game. It's just how I like Hyrule Warriors spin-off game. Good thing to know that Bubble never pays attention. <laughs> Still improving. Use your power to win the day for us. It was good. I'm eating yogurt now. Yogurt! Agnias arrow. Over right. Cannot hold any more supplies. SQ. Hi. SQ, also for you, I uh, stopped the encounter uh, thingy because there's n legit nothing else we can do with it. Everything has its use. And I'm too lazy to hunt behind people to fix it. Hey there, need something? Uh, let me expand facility first. Is this it? Is this it? Is this it? Can upgrade this one. Sure, let's upgrade. Is this it? It's free anyways. Right? See you around. Hey there. Now let's something. see what reforging exactly does. Oh, it becomes a plus ten. Oh, sick. Oh. So that's how it works. Cool. Let's 
See you around. Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. It's good to know that I know where I stand. <laughs> I am Elbaka. Let me know if I um, I was gonna give that other bow to Shamir. Bow Zoltan. Wrong one. Are you really though, SQ? Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Ready or not, here I come. You can't hide. Take your time, Bobo. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Okay, deliver resources. Everything has its use. Uh, marketplace is the last one needs to be leveled. Welcome. Ooh, black pearl. Nothing but the best for you. Come back soon. I carry a little of everything. Expand here. facility. Two more. I need per voice license. Hope to see you again soon. What did you already say? I said, are you sure, though? Yes. Okay, then it's good. Otherwise, I might Everything need to, <laughs> you know, cancel it. <laughs> Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. Everything is now fully developed. Let me know if I may be of further service. Well, how'd it go? The SR research team. 
Any results a good result. Which battlefield are you headed to? To the next one. case we're bringing you weren't I think we're bringing Lindhard in that case right I don't care much for battle and in your case we're bringing Bernadetta let's earn our keep I wish our enemy. Okay, uh, Bernie goes this way. Sure hope this goes. Oh, here I go. Edelgard goes no this way. They must learn who they're up against. Oh, Lindu Hearts goes this Keep way, this and Yordi does whatever the fuck he wants. I've got he was as disinterested in this fight as I am. United, we are unbeatable. Forward march! And don't let me catch you lagging behind! I mustn't bring shame upon my good name. This struggle will fall! This place won't be a problem anymore. It's time for the meditation. I face my comrades after this. Tell me somebody saw that. Just popcorn and chocolate. <laughs> I'd rather have nachos than popcorn. Still improving. Take this. Everybody's really proud of you. I'm sorry, team. We weren't strong enough. Here it comes. Out of the way. You're done. This is defeat. I'm sorry. Success was to be expected. Edelgard is done here. Here I go. No, they must learn who they're up against. Oh. Looks like that's it for us. Though I am reluctant to do this, I can see no other choice. It's no use. We can't gain any ground. Let's carve a swath through the battlefield. Here it comes. Our time has finally come. Ooh. It's Bernie's time to shine. Somebody help me. Where? Bing. There. Oops. Just the beginning. Such deeds make me want to believe your power rests in precisely the right person. 
Already on my way, already on my way, already on my way. Someone help me! Um Oh, if I must. Leave this to me. Site mission successful. I've got this. What a pain. Burn that on. I won't ever forget your kindness. Here I go. No mistakes. They must. Easy clap. Good thing I didn't slink off for a nap. Ooh, nice uh, lens of Sultan. Sick. Defeat the Warlock and the other enemies. Nadetta is okay here. Okay, so the only one that I want to switch is... Bolt this. Oh, yeah. The fight starts now. I'm going to... Okay. Here I go. No, this way. Must learn who they're up against. I'm on it. No chance. This way. Win, I'm going to smile while doing it. No messing around if we want to win. No, we have to do something. So this is defeat. I just realized that I can technically grab a curve sword and level that up. So this is defeat. I'm sorry. What can I say? I'm that good. Let's carve a swap through the battlefield. Because curved swords look cooler than this ugly ass thing. Yeah. <laughs> 
Where the fuck no do you chance. think you're going, Grimmery? You shall pay for this, you hear? This place won't be a problem anymore. Here I go. No game. I'm dragging the others down. This is I'm getting just the beginning. For my debut. Bitch, please. This battle is gonna instantly kick your ass. Booty slapped. Battles, apparently. Thanks for tipping me off. It was the push I needed. I've been grappling with what to do for a long time. If I'd had someone like you around, I might have made the right decision in the first place. I bet I'd be walking a very different path right now. Lester would sure be different. Maybe even all of Fodlan would be different. I think you're giving me too much credit. I don't know. I'm a pretty good judge of character. But anyway, if you don't have anything else lined up after the war, why not come with me? I think we make a pretty good team. Yeah, maybe we do. I'll give it some thought. That's all I could ask. But for now, I guess you know what to do next. Oh, I have a feeling that we're gonna get booby trapped here really badly. Yuritsa wants to go on expedition. 
I see. If you would. So I think I said it yesterday as well, but apparently uh, in the battle where I killed Gerald, I could have recruited both Gerald and uh, Byleth. Which I obviously didn't know before, but, well, you know, now I do. Uh, oh, here he is. You're, in You're inviting me? And our destination. This is our battlefield. I don't care. Doesn't care for sightseeing, he says. I can sense that you and those maggots are of the same ilk. Impressive. Impressive. My mother and sister remain in good health. That is all I... Enough. You there. Of course he enjoys Don't that. Don't bother inviting me to victory parties. I... I won't go. Thank you. Perfect conversation! Yeah! Sure, let's give him a gift. Likes Mercedes, sweets, and cats. Mm, his father. <laughs> These are all flowers, blue cheese, lovers of food and drink, old flower, and fishing. Oh. My, my gratitude. Wait, who likes Mercedes ass? I will take my leave. Yuritsa, but not ass, just likes Mercedes. In a family kind of way. Because they're family. Looks like something spooked it. What's wrong, little guy? Is someone chasing you? <laughs> Not that you'd be able to tell me anyway. Storms through the door. Yuritsa. Yuritsa? What's, What's wrong? wrong? Wait a sec. Why do I feel like this has happened before? There you are. Uh, yeah. What's up? Not you, her. The creature the who creature raided, raided the pantry. The pantry. <laughs> Wait, you mean the cat? She is swift. This is not the first time she has eluded my grasp. Not the first? Oh, so this is who you were chasing the last time. Yes, she was injured. I tried to tend to her, but she fled. Eventually, another soldier apprehended her. Here, do you know today Hika went to the outside world? Yeah, I know. So that's what was going on. It wasn't a person who went missing, it was a cat. Progress. Now that I think about it, I don't know if you ever said she was a person. Sorry for jumping to conclusions. The fault is mine as well. My one My choice, choice was, was poor. poor. Honestly, I'm more surprised than anything. Never really saw you as a cat person. I always thought your antisocial tendencies extended to everyone, human and animal. 
Not that much of a shut-in, as I may seem to give off. Yeah, SQ, Hiko isn't, uh, like, Bernadetta. Otherwise, I would have said that Hiko was, like, Bernadetta, not you. No kidding. So they weren't always scared of you? No. However, the cat vanished after my mother and sister left. Perhaps it was frightened by the sight of me covered in blood. I'm no cat expert, but they say animals can sense danger. Maybe it could tell that you'd become a threat somehow. <sighs> eh, cats are fickle. Anyway, what do you plan to do once you've caught this bread bandit? Take her with me, and make sure she never steals again. What's that supposed to mean? Look, you practically scared the whiskers right off her. I only planned to give her some food. <laughs> it's, it's due to the way you say it, Iritsa. Yeah, Come on, my dude. It's be a while till she realizes you just want to help. <laughs> I'm gonna make sure she never steals again. if we can capture this stronghold. I'm sorry. We weren't strong enough. All would be lost if I were to die here. Let's keep it going. So this is defeat. I'm sorry. Question of can. Only a matter of will. For you shall pay for this. You hear? Don't mind if I do. Let's get started. To the next one. Everybody's really proud of you. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
You'll have to take things from him. We'll show them how determined we are. You shall pay for this, you hear? Retreat is a vital strategy. Take it. So this is defeat. I'm sorry. Not a bad way to test my skills. Easy clap. I'm getting goosebumps here. Eating sugar all day and I see chocolate box. What do I do? Uh, put the chocolate in the refrigerator. Hey, I actually won! Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. He was thinking hard to herself. What does he mean by putting it in the refrigerator? It's not a yes or no to me eating all this chocolate. Soldiers of the Empire. Then I would say indeed. I'm going to doze off. I just know it. Let's earn our keep. None will. Here I go. No mistakes. I'm on it. No charge, just stand between us and the bright new future I envision. No messing around if you want to win.
Leave this to me. Here I go. No. Nope. Still improving. Your power appears to be a thing you mastered all on your own. We're not losing to anyone. Yeah. And watch for an opportunity to strike back. Axe, fists, magic. It looks like this one isn't gonna come easy. We do have Edelgard with us. Here I go. No mistake. Oh, they swapped her out. They must hurry. It's no use. We can't gain any ground. Let's see how much damage Jordy already has done on this guy. Disappointing. Oops. 
Okay. Oh, still need to grab it, but that's fine. Um, training instructor. Training can be the difference between victory and defeat. There must be. Training can be the difference between victory and defeat. See, Dorothea and Monica are the only two that are not level 55 yet. The rest will have to wait if I need to do them with a specific quiz thing. Can't wait to see how you do. Care to make yourself useful? Whew. Perfect moment for Yordi to go to the toilet and nothing to worry take about with the two of you on the job. I don't know how you stay focused. Every time I think about the war and how much is left to be done, I grow so impatient for the end. Do not be discouraged. Instead, focus on how much you have accomplished in so short a time. Um, mitigation. Oh. Well. Yes, it, we all must do our fair share. Okay, next battle. Showdown at Ailel. I have a feeling that Cloud is going to betray us. Everyone, 
Lend me your ears. Soon we will arrive in the Valley of Torment, where our Imperial allies will fight for supremacy against the forces of the Kingdom and Central Church. This is certain to be a violent and bloody battle. Death will indeed feast well this day. So think long and hard. Is this what you want? Yes, we signed a pact with the Empire, but only under duress after they overran our lands. I knew it. And what was the other option? To side with the corrupt church and the kingdom they cling to? Never. A false choice is no choice at all. But now, right here and now, the Leicester Alliance has a chance to turn the tables. <laughs> He's gonna make it a free-for-all, the Royal bitch. Friends, brave allies, fellow visionaries. Will we accept an emperor who pays for her needless wars in the coin of our blood? Will we submit to an archbishop and a king who would shackle us to their outmoded customs? I say no. I say never. And this day, on this battlefield, we stake a claim to a future of our own making. This day, we help these monsters destroy themselves and claim this world for our own. This day, we declare war against the Empire and the Kingdom. I take it you heard the ill news, Your Majesty? Moments ago, yes. I don't get it. Why would the Alliance want to make enemies of both the Empire and the Kingdom? It doesn't make any sense. I underestimated you, Claude. I didn't. Are we really in this situation? Holy shit! Summon Lion's Wyverns to reveal the imposters. Jordan goes in, obvious. Edelgard. Balthus. I think Linhardt is indeed a good option to have in here as well. Monica, Ferdinand, etc. Okay. Sick though. This is uh, literally unexpected. 25 minutes, 1800. Okay. Going for an S rank. of the church to think we would all meet in such a cramped locale hold on does anyone actually see the knights of saros amidst all this i wonder if they're not even here to begin with <laughs> yeah they went ahead to garrick mach we strike at the imperial army today do not let the alliance distract you yes as you command the party's already starting huh it's too bad we couldn't throw it for something a little more civilized. Would it kill you to be serious for once, Claude? Ah, there's there are nice Aceros. They're gonna join the party late. 
For the last time, Flane, I am against this. It is not too late to retreat. And for the last time, I intend to fight. Besides, it would seem the battle is about to begin. <sighs> well then, just give the command, Edelgard. Good. Our very hope depends on you. Brave warriors of Adrestia, the time has come to demonstrate the Empire's valor, to prove our supremacy. Any who dare stand in our way must be cut down. Now! As one, attack! Now! As one, attack! Okay. Uh, let's start with this it's Bernie's time to shine I'm gonna help okay there's not a question of can let us face our foes as one I will gladly handle this allow me to work with you right then let us shall we join hands in battle again okay. uh you stay put Lintharp is gonna go charge up front. Stay on defense, and same for Edelgard. Don't actually have any offensive capabilities right now, so you're staying on the defense as well. Would appear someone has let our plans The enemy knew precisely how to box us in. We will be torn apart if we fail to forestall the enemy. Seize their forward stronghold. Push their lines back. As you. What did you do with the box of chocolate? Did you put it in the refrigerator like I told you to? I mean, this is the reason why I kept two guys in the back. You people do love your bloodshed. See, horse. I'm on it. Just leave it to me. Oh, if I. Little guards, is she under attack? In a bit, yeah. I think she's fine. Just need to swap over to her on time. If necessary, that is. Really, can I walk over this lava like uh, it's nobody's business? So too can our enemy. Now is not the time. Don't 
do not have fear. If we are taking control of one stronghold at a time, we will prevail. Oh, leave this to me. Status, battle details. I'm gonna stop the lava. Timing is good enough. We should be able to take our troops across now that the ground has cooled. Look, the lava stopped. They're wide open. Attack! It seems we were too hasty with us. No, we weren't. We were perfect. I already kicked most of their asses. Job, Lintard. Jesus, they keep. Not a problem. And looks like um, they keep sending more enemies. Lintard is getting his ass kicked here. I can use a hand. Watch my back. <laughs> Do you mind taking charge? How's this? Felix has appeared. My I'll carve my way right through them. Oh, if I must. Take a breather. Not on my watch, pal. All right, you'll do. No, it's just sitting in front of me crying. Just put it in the fridge. Otherwise, it'll get too hot and it'll melt. Or else. I hope you're 
watching, Ingrid. Today is the day I avenge you. Um. Yeah, no, you won't. I hope you're ready to part with your head, because I mean to lay it at my friend's grave. Oh, if I'm up. Watch this. Take a breather. <laughs> This is nothing compared to the pain she felt. It's magic chocolate, it doesn't melt. Every chocolate melts, especially nowadays in this fucking heat. Forgive me, Your Majesty. May fortune favor you in battle. Not a problem. I can't just sleep. Very well. Not you too, Sylvain. What am I supposed to do now? Die. With the rest of your stupid ass empire. Uh, kingdom. I'm on it. Let's go. My turn. How much time has passed in the meantime? Six minutes. I do have 25, but I think I might need to start making some aggro options soon. Charge this way with Yordi. I, can't just I don't know what Edelgard's doing all the fucking way outside of the camp. But I'm going to make an offensive charge. Stay put here. What a pain. Take a breather. None will pass on my watch. That is super oh, the wrong way, Yordi. I was not planning on fighting you in this area. I was going this area, I mean. Do. 
Lane appeared. Wait, you honestly think you can out heal me? The second coming of Saint Sethlene. Strike her down and put an end to it already. Say, check out that boulder. I wonder if we can use it to block the lava and reach the other side. Oh. Real quick swift to Baltus. Why must you hurt each other like this? You are all brothers and sisters. Towards where Edelgard is. Protect this war master. I can't just sleep. This is so unlikely. before it can truly begin. It's unnerving how well we're doing. I hope that means we're headed for a quick victory. Just start bringing in the pain! <laughs> Fuck did he come from? Camps keep spawning as well, it's super annoying. Got this. 
Now, give the signal. The Empire is fanned out to the north and south. Split them in two and box them in. Shit's on the stick. Reinforcements have appeared in the middle of our ranks. Okay, that's not gonna... No, 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 we need to... Edelgard should be fine around here, though. For the time being, at least. There's no time to regroup. Just deal with them as best you can and minimize casualties. As we slipped our agents into. Let us join forces. We're going for broke. It's over. Well, if this is our fearless leader's big mope, I'm on it. Mint, I guess I can pitch in. Since the enemy already discovered our agents, watch my back. <laughs> Do you mind taking charge? How's this? Oh, if I must. I wish I could just flee and avoid all of this fighting. Nice one. This is a nice battle, though, not gonna lie. Fighter 05. How much damage? 15% only still. I think so, the do. The D. The D. The D. The D. The D. And not just slim, mate. Like, I am gonna completely destroy you. Please, I cannot afford to lose you. things over here. I'm on it. No need you to go and clean up some more enemies for me. Everyone, here I go. They must learn. I'm way over my head. But I'm not How Are you uh, doing Lindy? You're not doing anything. Oh, it's no. Setting up until it's over. We are losing the battle. I must act. 
Oh look, it's my favorite party of buttholes. Seth it. Such deeds make me want to believe your power rests in precisely the right person. Job Edel guards. That's what I like to see. Here I go. No mistakes. Let's take out this holy knight. I'm on it. No charge. Kill them. What a pain. Hey, I chose this, but if you really want to be nice to me, you could always step aside. Fucking hell. Not a problem. Already dead. Call it off when you need to, Hilda. There's no shame in falling back. Thanks, Claude. But I'll be okay so long as the archers are with me. Uh, no, she won't. Eyes on those enemy archers. We can't eliminate them on your command. Things aren't looking so hot. I told you to get out of there, Hilda. Now back off and let me take over. Where is he? Sorry, Claude. And good luck. We're the best! I'll follow your lead! I've got you now! Enough messing around. You'll have to contend with me now. Already beat yo ass, yo. Who's behind the door here? Appreciate strategy. Do it. Take out the archers. How did the Empire get behind us? Hubert set us up. I should have known he'd have a dozen tricks up his sleeve. That was a good strategy, but not good enough. And now, look what I've done to all of you. 
Cloud is actually dead now. It's not what you wanted, Cloud. But the world won't forget your ambition, because it will live on through me. I take the field. Every last one of them will yield to me, or they shall perish. Time to beat Dimitri's ass. Courage now. The time has come to bring our war with the kingdom to its end. Take control of the whole area. Our victory must be beyond question. Hey Dimitri, are you gonna run after me, boy? Conflict ends here. I shall see to your demise with my own two hands. I'm up against the king of Fargus himself. But I'm not about to back best? down. I'll follow your lead! Should try to stop me, bitch. Leaves the enemy leaders. Don't kill me out! It's not too late, Dimitri. Sever ties with the central church and return to your people. And I'm to believe that will end your aggression? You'll come for me anyway. Your thirst for blood is unquenchable. I like that he actually thinks Edelgard's thirst is for blood. So funny. Okay, now it's time to go beat Byleth's ass. I must retreat. There's no time to give chase. Still, this is a victory for the Empire all the same. Yeah, they kept us guessing, but at least we... What's that? Butcher most vile. You killed the sire of this vessel, and now you die for it! Atone at once! It's me, the monster wants, so let's give the Ashen Demon a fitting end. We'll hear the best! I'll follow your lead! I've got you now! Do this! Defeat Byleth once and for all. We got the boo ending. 
You've finally done it. The Ashen Demon is no more. Mm-hmm. You don't sound too pleased with yourself. Yeah, I don't know. I know I should be. But now that it's over, I just feel kind of... empty. What if all this was just some horrible mistake? What if there was another way we could have solved all this? There was. Sorry. I shouldn't be dumping all this on you. There's nothing to apologize for. You're processing a lot right now. I'm not sure what it means to feel happy and empty and regretful all at the same time. But I think I'm going through it myself, too. Though I wouldn't call it happy, per se. More like free. Like I finally finished a quest I thought would never end. The relief could practically move me to tears. I... Hey, are you crying? I'm... I'm not sure. But I do know this. I'm beyond grateful for everything you've done for me. I couldn't have asked for a better partner in destiny. Same here, friend. So yeah, this uh, this is a ending, <laughs> sort of, because Byleth is dead. Not actually at the I end of the game or the here. story yet. Jesus, look at all the weapons. Lumpel's shield. <sighs> Why is so fucking A last minute betrayal like that should have been the end of us. This is a massive victory, and yet something bothering you where was the archbishop where was the main force of the knights of seros where do you Never think relished a battle like this yet she was nowhere to be found what do you think no hubert let me ask you something when the archbishop escaped from garrick mock we found no evidence of how she managed to reach this valley correct Indeed. We searched high and low, but it was only by chance that we picked up her trail in ALL. That is how we knew she had entered the kingdom. Without that clue, she would have been in the wind. Just as I suspected. What is it, Ferdinand? Is Garrick Mock in danger? Of course. There must be a secret path that connects this valley to the monastery. Rhea and the Knights might be using it to attack Garrick Mock right now. It's certainly possible. Hubert, your thoughts? I will look into it. But I am almost certain that Ferdinand's theory is correct. We should assume this is the case and take action immediately. Of course it is correct. Very wise of you to see that. In that case, we'll divide our troops. The main force will proceed with occupying Galatea. We'll lead the remaining third south to Garrick Mock. <coughs> path forward. Blaze. A path forward. The Empire manages to prevail over the Kingdom and Central Church's coalition, despite the Alliance's declaration of war. But Archbishop Rhea is nowhere to be found. 
Edelgard and the others soon realize the Archbishop aims to <coughs> trails to lead a surprise attack <coughs> Mach, so the Empire regroups and moves to intervene. <coughs> Dionysus, my lord. <coughs> huh? What now? What's happened? Another fire? That's a <coughs> It's an assassin! Where's the body? Uh, no, my lord. Worse. There's a legion of soldiers closing in on Garrett Mach. We think <clears throat> it's the Knights of Seros. Uh. But we're safe in here, yes? My life is of great military importance, you know. Protect me! Put those troops Her Majesty sent to use! Count Varley. The enemy is inside the monastery. We couldn't hold them back. But these walls are thick. How did they breach them? This the is their home territory. Stand, my lord. But it appears they have made use of a number of unknown <coughs> secret passages. Now they are inside and wreaking havoc, and it's only a matter of time before the monastery falls. We have the numbers to stop them, but that matters little if we don't know where they actually are. We must flee, my lord. All hope is lost. Urgent news, my lord. Spare my life, I beg you. An unknown army has appeared and started attacking the Knights of Saros. Unknown army? Your Majesty's reinforcements. Doubtful, my lord. This army wields large-scale magic and is also attacking the Imperial forces. Oh! The battlefield is sheer chaos. It's impossible to tell friend from foe. The ones that slither in the dark. Blazes is happening. <clears throat> Church or empire, I care not. Phallus, there he is. Engulf them in our darkness. It will be done. At last, we can finally give the foolish descendants of those beasts the lesson they deserve. We will expose their filthy underground resting place and steal every last one of their essences. If we can breach it. The hole in the forest that the bandits raided was secured with a seal. Shall we deal with it after we take the monastery? Tear this disgusting rat's nest apart. Lady Rhea, who are these people? They're attacking both sides indiscriminately. A clandestine organization that wields dark magic. Could it be? Have they returned to seek vengeance on Fodlan? But why show their hand now? Deal with them, Catherine. Not a single one of them can survive. They pose a far greater threat to our world than the Empire. Yes, Lady Rhea. <clears throat> Make way for Thunder Catherine! Clear a path or die! Clear a path or die! Love that. And that appears to be the current situation. The Knights of Saros are one thing. We came prepared to deal with them, and we can do so. But now you say those who slither in the dark have turned this into a three-way battle? Why? I am as baffled as you regarding a possible motive. Perhaps it was vital they seized the monastery before we could get here. If they knew we were engaged in a lengthy fight at ALL, they might have seen this as their chance. Well, they saved Count Farley's life either way. So be it. We will use this situation to our advantage and conduct a rescue. We can't afford to lose Garrick Mach or Count Varley. With one battle, we'll destroy the Central Church and put an end to those who slither in the dark. <coughs> it's strange. I stopped caring about my father a long time ago, but the thought that he might die is... It's... He is not dead yet, Bernadetta. Unless you intend to be leaving him to his fates. No. No, of course not. I'm going to save him. 
If we're sloppy about this, we'll get dragged into the ongoing battle and suffer heavy losses. I would prefer to make this as easy for ourselves as we can. Let's find out what's going on in there, then look for the safest way in. I can tell you one thing. If Lord Arundel is here, I will choke the life out of him personally. <laughs> I let you watch, Your Majesty. Yes, just try, try not, not to overdo, overdo it. it. If that is settled, we will accomplish nothing more by brooding down here. Agreed. We'll begin the attack as soon as our preparations are complete. We just go into a main quest mission right now? I do hope so, I don't want to... Heck yes. <laughs> Might sound a little bit annoying, but I don't want to deal with a lot of mini quests before this one. <clears throat> Suggestions to prepare. I have a stratagem. I have a strategy. I will endeavor my hardest. Shall we? Merc whistled to someone while I still have the chance. You know what? Let's give it to. Um... Guard wherever she is. Do you have a moment? I'm truly nearing the end. What do you think we'll do? Uh, you will do after this. Personally, I hope you continue to support the Empire or well me. You need not decide immediately, but would you tell me when the time comes? You will not receive another one until you've completed the game. Yes. And what have we here? I suppose it's only right. I give you the Imperial Coat of Arms pen. A very special friend. Over here. Do you have a moment? Listen, there's a chance Lord Arundel may finally make an appearance, you know. The man's responsible for put uh, he must not be allowed to cause any more trouble for her. Therefore, you and I shall you and I are going to end him. Got it. We'll make sure he doesn't get anywhere near Edelgard, not unless Her Majesty wants him close. If she wishes to confront him herself, then we mustn't interfere. Oh, right. Okay, so this is the final battle. Hm. We never did obtain any clues as to your royal identity, but if Thalus appears at Garrick Mach and we succeed in killing him, we'll sp the end of their ill points and for all. The question is, would you truly find such a conclusion satisfying? Huh? Sure. What do I care? Good with how I am now. <laughs> Quite a bold statement. If only our pasts could always be dealt with so easily. I mean, technically, you can deal with your pasts that easily. Never expect the Alliance to break our pact and attack us. I know their leader, Claude, is a bit of a schemer. But I didn't think he was the type to make a reckless gamble. I could have driven him to do that. Goodness me. I suspect the rift would eventually occur, but I did not predict Claude would betray us so soon. It is to become of me. I am loyal to the Empire. Territory is in Leicester. Maybe forever mired in this predicament if the Empire fails to unify Flotland. 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 I think I say Flotland completely the wrong way. But who cares at this point? Ear? Baron Barbana, Barnabas, the general in charge of Garrick Mach, is ups uh, upsetting. Am I a uh, amiable fellow? We would defend the monastery with his life if it came to it, but we must make sure that doesn't happen. The Empire would also suffer great loss were he to die. Let's see. Those who slither in the dark are trying to wipe out the Emperor, the Archbishop, at the same time. Then we have to win no matter what. We should also expect our leader to show up. The problem is, I won't be able to get the information I need during the chaotic fight. Which means I'll simply have to subdue them. Don't slip through my fingers. 
Garak Machis are and so too is the work of defending it. Hmm. Fortunately, our opponents are far more familiar with the monastery than we are. This will be the most arduous battle. Yeah. Ah. I'm surprised that you of all people would be worried. Do be careful not to underestimate I us too much. Honest. Let us meet them head on. I, Ferdinand von Eyer, shall ensure our victory. My instruction comes at a high price. What a fascinating power. What a fascinating power. What a fascinating power. Spent all the monies. I must make the most. I imagine this will serve me well. This power will serve me at times. I need more strength than this. I need more strength than this. Don't think we can max out everyone's abilities in the army. Can't let this power go. Can't let this power go. Hey, anything that makes me stronger. Um. Not that there's any point in oh, this is good for some oh, this is good for something. Bernadetta Real quick go to Balthus, because he is used as well often. I didn't even realize that fighting as Balthus gives me money. That is fucking hilarious. Okay, Petra, just in case that uh, Sep comes running in and decides to be like, WHERE IS MY BABY PETRA? Ah, that's it. Don't neglect your daily studies. <clears throat> Bernadetta. It feels so weird that we're going to help my father. Not that I'm against it, I can't wait to see him cry! Right on. That's spare, teach him a lesson. Not that I know what for, but yeah! Yeah, I can do this! Good day to you. How may I help you? Do you have need of me? Perhaps you wish me wish me to aid you with Garrick Mach. Feel free to use me as a decoy or make me pretend to surrender. Or have me sabotage them from underground. I care not what to do. Uh, sabotage? Are you pulling something? Can I be of use? Not really. I just have a talent of destruction. After all, my failed experiments. Got a second. I honestly don't know if I have the guts to turn my sword against the Archbishop. I mean, Rhea. But if those are my orders, then I must carry out my duty as an Imperial General. I just really hope we don't get hit with some kind of divine retribution for capturing or killing her. You mean like her turning into a dragon? <laughs> Got a minute. I'm really expecting her to actually turn into a dragon again. I mean, at the end of Three Houses on this side, she turned into a dragon. The Knights of Saros weren't out in full force at Elio. The rest of them must have been on their way to Garrick Mach. Keep close eyes on the close eye on the Emperor. They'll do anything. Nothing to report. I wonder who's guarding my old gate now. I'm dying to know, but I can't leave my post to join the really rescue. Would you drop by and find out for me, please? <laughs> Excuse me. I, I was actually born in a town under in a town underneath Garrick Mach. I was worried when the Empire first took over, but day-to-day -day life hardly changed there at all. If anything, I hear business has picked up, not that it affects me. Eric Mach smack dab in the middle of Flotland, right? Yeah. Foland. I think it's Foland, I pronounce it, but fuck it. I know it's got historic significance, but is it really worth sacrificing so many lives over? Let's see. It's a huge building, probably with some crazy catacombs underneath. Who knows what kind of secrets might be hiding down there? You think so too, huh? Definitely worth some suspicious passages beneath the monastery. I heard that you avenged, avenged Randolph, so I rushed over as fast as I could. Thank you. I'm certain he will rest in peace now. 
But I was so focused on getting revenge, I have no idea what to do with myself now. Live a happy life like Randolph would have wanted. I've done is fight for more than two years. I've hardly had an opportunity to find that special someone. And now here we are. Sorry, people must be blind if they're turning a blind eye and using your charm. You're the only one who recognizes this at all, our cruel world. Get a move on, Commander. I've got friends defending Garrick Mach. I don't care if we're squaring off with those awful dark mages or the Knights of Serals. We're definitely gonna win, right? Interesting. Welcome. Do you have anything I can buy? No. Thanks a bunch. Thanks a bunch. Death shall not come for you in this battle, the stars have decreed it, though they get things wrong sometimes. At the very least, you should steer clear of bridges. It would appear you are in danger of falls. Uh, okay. Any Ingrid and Sullivan were all my dear friends. They fought so bravely to protect what they believed in. I'm not sure I could ever do that myself. That's why I think they were so incredible. Aw. I do hope the bishop's alright. If, perchance, he were to pass away, I wonder who would take his place in the southern church. No, no, that is... That is most inappropriate to say. Right now, we must focus on rescuing him. It's fine, it's only human. So I've been thinking. The Minister of Religious Affairs... Oh, right, he's a bishop now. In any case, Count Varley is currently holed up in Garrick Mach, right? Personally, I'd love to hear him cry like a stuck pig, but I suppose with the way things are, we have no choice but to rescue him. Did something happen between you two? No idea you ever knew each other. He put me through a great deal of pain a long time ago. It was my own fault, but still. I just can't believe there wasn't anyone else more suited to act as some church bishop. As a believer, I have more than a few reservations about someone like him heading the church. I hope all our great leaders will take that into consideration after the war. My sincerest apologies for not noticing the Archbishop's movement. By the time I realized what was happening, her forces were already marching on Garrick Mach. But at least they were hindered somewhat when that third force arrived and caused so much confusion. It was helpful in a way. The Valley of Torment lived up to its name. All those people crammed into that narrow ravine. I'll never forget the sight of it for as long as I live. <clears throat> no matter how much I wish I could scrub it up. Ugh. I need to think about something else. What's next? Are we all ready to go? Let's think about that. I think this battle is going to make a major turning point to fall and history. It's overwhelming to think that I'll be part of that. If I survive, I want to paint a picture of the battle. I feel like somehow it's my duty to do so. I've been waiting. We have nothing more to fear, Yordi. No matter who or what you face, we will be able to save this Shall world. We? Now let us be off. We shall fight till the bitter end. Excuse me. Hmm. Most of this war is behind us, which means fewer chances to make a name for myself. I need to pull out all the stops in the next battle, or you're gonna leave me in the dust. Seriously though, I've got your back if you've got mine. Hear me out. Yep, I called it. I knew they were going places. I can just follow your lead and try not to get killed. You know what they say, the better things are going, the more arrows come your way. I mean, interesting way of saying it. Did you know? I know it's kind of late to bring this up, but I don't agree with how we've been fighting. I just feel the same way, right? Come on, you can tell me. Yeah, I'm not a fan. We don't exactly show mercy to our enemies, maybe. It's not like we're the only ones doing that. That's just war, you know? What do you have a problem with? 
We fight all day, but never get the party. Edelgard just doesn't get it. <laughs> you get the party once the war is over, mate. He marches over every hill and dill. In this weather have been ruthless. It's difficult enough to walk, let alone fight battles. Everything has been utterly inf insufferable, though I suppose that's to be expected in the war. Are you sure? You seriously think Marchin's all that bad? Well, whatever, I guess. At least when the war is over, we won't have to travel around as much. I certainly hope so. Wouldn't mind the exhaustion if it were on a research trip, but this is ridiculous. I've been thinking about what justice really means ever since I left Fergus, and I still haven't figured it out. I wonder if I ever will. You'll work out what it means to you someday, even if it's a struggle now. Thanks. Thanks, bro! At last, we will finally annihilate those who slither in the dark. <clears throat> I forgot the voice, I can't redo it anymore. There were times I had to fight alongside them after the Emperor hired me. But they truly make my blood boil. I wish to crush them like the insects they are. I warn you, do not get in my way. I wasn't planning on I'm just not putting you in the back. <laughs> yeah, a minute. We might have more fighting to do after this, but I've got a feeling this next battle is going to determine Folan's future. You should probably start thinking about your next step, you know? What you're going to do once the fighting's over. <laughs> I'm going to bang the Empress. <laughs> when I'm returning to Bridget, I can be holding my head high. Because I'm thinking our relationship with the Empire will be fine now. I hope someday more people will be going between Bridget and Folland. Folland. I keep wanting to say Flotland. Folkland. Did you know? I've cut off contact with my adoptive father for now. But I believe I will return home someday. So I want to fight as hard as I can alongside all of you while I'm here. This will be a significant battle for Folland's future after all. <sighs> Hunger is the true enemy. Ow. Um I noticed that uh, the main character is not very good at cooking. <laughs> he just, he just, he's just not very good at it. Edelgard and Ferdy. Oh. Come back whenever you're hungry. Hunger is the true enemy. Um, Monica is definitely coming along, most likely. Oh, perfect, really. How did? Oh. How did you know this was my favorite? Come back whenever you're hungry. Hunger is the true enemy. I smell that kind of stuff from uh, five miles away. Petra. I could still work on some social bondings, but I really feel like it. Wait. Come back whenever you're hungry. Hunger is the true enemy. What's left is the awakening thingy. Baltus and Shamir, culinary commander. Hey. Must mean that I've cooked enough. Hey, my favorite. Someone knows. Me. Come back whenever you're hungry. Okay. Chore master. Volunteer. Organizing documents. Wow. Yes. We all must 
Do you care to make yourself useful? Care for the horsies. <gasps> Aw, only great. We all must do our best to make yourself useful. Okay, now we just need to do the battle training. To work you into shape. Go breaker. What? Is Time to work you with proper okay. training. You'll be unstoppable. Um, they already got everything set here, right? Yeah. You were to absorb magic. Grants a minor boost of mech each time an enemy commander is defeated, the boost lasts throughout the battle. That is nice. Nullify Calvary effect. Nullifies effectiveness against Calvary units. I don't really I don't really understand what that means. Absorb resistance. But honestly, who the fuck gives a shit at this point? Vendetta doesn't have any other moves. The core expertise. Patience. Hitting an enemy while they are readying an attack rate increase that. Ooh, nice. Wisdom. Baltus didn't have anything either. gonna make an extra save file real quick by the way because I don't necessarily know what it means now that we uh, are at the end of the line so just in case we still have another do we Yeah, let's do this one real quick. Then do another double save or just one save extra. Are you even listening to me, Linhart? I know. <laughs> <coughs> oh Jesus! What did you see, Caspar? Oh, I heard you the first time. I just think you misunderstood what your eyes were telling you. Oh, Linhart. Didn't have a head. What could I possibly misunderstand about that? From a distance, many things could resemble the indistinct shape of a headless torso. It's irrational to assume it was a ghost. There must be a simpler and more scientific explanation. Wait, you guys use magic and you don't believe and in you'll ghosts? you never convince me otherwise, no matter how much you howl. So best to just let it go. You're being real stubborn about this. Wouldn't it be easier to just mumble something about how he might be right and move on? A fair point. But you see... Father? Well, this is unexpected. 
You too, Father? What are you doing here? I had some matters to discuss with Her Majesty and prefer to do so in person. And I came to consider the continued unrest in the east of the Empire with the court. And you thought it might be nice to pay your dear sons a visit while you were in the area. A sensible conclusion. Death awaits around every corner in these times. Each visit could be our last. You are a fountain of positivity, my son. We're not just here to bandy words. There's a fight waiting for us, and a lot of you are going to help. Uh, all of us? He can't possibly be counting me among those slated to help, can he? Father? I was against the idea, but as you might imagine, Count Burgley's would have none of it. You know some of the former Prime Minister's rebel sympathizers escaped, yes? Well, we've tracked them down in a town near to here. Leopold means to mount an attack and wipe them out in one fell swoop. With just us? I hope you have more troops on the way. Sorry, but this is all we've got. My army's engaging the kingdom on the Western Front, and Her Majesty's forces are busy with preparations for the next battle. Now come, we don't have much time. Right, got it. And what do you think will happen to us if we let the two of them go it alone and they end up dead? Hmm? Oh, fine. As you said, it's not like we can talk the Count out of anything once he's set his mind to it. And Caspar is just as bad. That apple is so close to the tree, it may as well be part of the roots themselves. I assume we can count on you as well, friend. It will be a hard battle, <coughs> and I cannot vouch for our safe return should you refuse. Don't see how I can say no when you put it like that. You're just as bad as Count Burgley's in your own special way. You appear to have a bond of mutual trust. Nicely done, son. I'm not sure that's how I'd phrase it, but moving on. If we're going to do this thing, I suggest we move out and do it already. Yeah, if we don't hurry, Caspar and his dad will be drowning in bad guys before we even get our boots laced. Come on, we gotta catch up. See, I knew I could rely on you. Hmm, I get the feeling this is going to be quite the bump. This looks like an uh, easy fight. Okay, so Yordi is going south. Kaspar and Leinhardt are joining up together. Seems like an easy enough battle. So much for catch. Oh, if I must. If my assistance is needed. Searching the enemy unprepared. Though no matter, we'll wipe out what's left of this rebellion regardless. That racket you caused outside the town certainly didn't help. Still, at least they've been drawn out. How many? I need 1200 kills. Shouldn't be too hard. It's been a while since I fought alongside my father. Better step it up. Even more than you usually do? In that case, I'll try to keep out of your way. Are you kidding? My usual approach would get blasted away by my father's battle cry alone! A good point. I'll stay away from him as well. When did we two last fight side by side? During the Troubles in Enbar, perhaps? Quite recently. Hopefully things go better this time Ura! 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 
come and face me. I can stop us. Just because shits and giggles, I'm gonna send you guys past the camp we need to take. I have some extra time. the 15 minutes. We're already on 600 kills. That's good. Not a problem. About time. I haven't actually had the chance yet to play Caspar while he's on the Wyvern. It's just since I put him back to X, he's not really been useful since Edelgard is also an X user. Be honest, honest, it plays kind of wonky. See what the ult looks like. Oh, wait, I've seen that already. Take a breather. Hey, what's that noise? Are they on to us? These bandits seem unrelated to the rebels. Still, we might as well deal with them. Oh. Blowing down weak enemies is so very dull. What say you, Caspar? Care to compete over which group can rack up more kills? You and Count Hevering versus the three of us? I like those odds! I don't. I mean, we're already on 800. Or you can leave us out of your absurd contest entirely. Come on, Baldemar. You're falling behind. I don't know why you insist on this foolish competition, you hold. You know full well I can never keep up with you. By the way, what are your older boy? I understand he was taken captive. He lives, but the temporary loss of mercy has had dire repercussions. I fear we must reassess. So. This is fitness for the Berkeley's man. Yeah. Too easy. Nice work. Again. More bandits over there, Baldemar. Warp me in. Another one-man assault. Well, 
If that's what you want. Well, if that's what you want. Nice one meal damage. A wise man is ever ready. Would you like to be warped as well, Caspar? I personally think it's a terrible idea, but I'll let you make your own decision. No thanks. I'm running on pure clean Caspar power this time. Cheating. I'm feeling great, Father. What about you? Need you even ask? Yeah. Thanks to my training, my stamina is the envy of men half my age. Here it comes. You're done. I like this mission. <laughs> I can't help it. This just feels like uh Keeping score of who's <laughs> getting more kills. How can I dislike that? Just turns the game into a slightly more fun time, except uh, rather than all the angsty shenanigans. Mostly bandits, I guess. I don't see very many rebels. What's all the commotion? Wonder attack and fuck back, you idiots! Ah, you guys can do whatever the fuck you want. Should I? You know what? I'll split the two up. A spark can probably handle three dark bishops, right? Though I am reluctant to do this, I can see no other choice. Overbearing oaf who doesn't even pretend to listen to me. He is the worst, and I curse fate for seeing fit to saddle us together since birth. Just sounds like a lover's quarrel if yet. Roll, roll, roll. I don't know how to pronounce that word. If you ask me. My accomplishments won't be you need to go help our buddy. He's kicking ass, but you still need to go help him. Somehow, this doesn't surprise me at all. Go on ahead, 
to escort the prisoners. Wait, we didn't? I thought it was about the kills, not about... Are they actually gonna... Promise to match your intensity. If I'd known that, I would have decided to kill less. As much as I expected, he says. Cringe. Show me what you've learned. Every technique and talent hold nothing back. Here it comes. Out of the way. You're done. Impressive. Holy shit. Holy shit, look at the damage that he does to me! Irving's prayer troops. Was it? I won't. Wyvern Lord Master. Hey, no flies flying facts. Another insanely strong. Save over the second file. Then we can instantly go into the next file. <laughs> so you finally bested your old man, huh? I'm proud of you, Kaspar. And Linhart, you've come a long way as well. Oh, and it puts my mind at ease to know these two have a companion like you around. Don't you agree, Valdemar? Well, the mod. Peace of mind I may have gained will doubtless be wiped out soon by more of your antics, Leopold. Leopold. Yes, as one never knows what will happen on the battlefield, it is always good to have capable allies. Wow, did you hear that? My father isn't easily impressed, so you must have really knocked his greaves off back there. It's an honor to get complimented by such a renowned military mind. Ha! Well, if you ever want to test your might, you know where to find me. I don't think that was ever on the table. No? Well, that's disappointing. <laughs> anyway, here. A reward for all the work you put in. Consider this as a thank you for letting me drag you all on my little adventure. Is he giving us? Hey, now we're talking. 
After all those years as a merc, I always expect some kind of reward after a tough battle. You throw yourself vigorously into the fray to help your friends, yet also keep a tight grip on the strings of your purse. You would make for a fine civil servant if you ever had the inclination. Tempting, but I think I'd rather fight people than paperwork. Guys like me aren't cut out for the civilized life. I prefer to let my sword do the talking. Wait, you have a talking sword? What? Of course not. <laughs> if only you trained your mind with the same vigor as your muscles, my son. Hey, speaking of minds, where's Linhart? He's been awfully quiet through all this. <laughs> Did he seriously just pass out? Hmm. Oh, are we going? Wow, look at that. I have a second wind. Just enough energy to get me home and into bed. Monster Strength Ring. Oh, that's the stats uh, ring I like to hear. <clears throat> Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Okay, last save for backup, just in case. And then we get another save before the battle, most likely, like before, but... The defense of Gadikma. And we'll do that. Oh, it actually says final chapter. That's so... I don't know. Thankfully, we're not too late. Count Varley is still holding strong. If the reports can be trusted, Rhea is here. And so is a mage that fits the description of Arendelle. Which is to say, Talus. That puts our two biggest adversaries in one place. We should deal with them here and now. Only one thing to do. Give it my all and prove you picked the right merc for the job. Indeed. I look forward to it. There has to be some Just big you know, twist, right? I've already proven that a dozen times over. Then I'm still a few dozen short. I gotta show you what the mercenary spirit's all about. This is my first time hearing of such spirit, but I'm eager to see it in action. Enough idle chatter, though. Everyone is in place. It's time to commence the final battle. We're gonna win. For you, for me, for all of us. And for a new Fodlin. One that'll go down in the history books as the best ever. Defeat Ray and Thalys. Either group of units is routed. Okay, we got 40 tactic points. Hubert and Ferdinand loose on the enemy. Mm -mm. Okay, let's go with this one. And then... this one. Okay, so Hubert needs to be in and Ferdinand needs to be in. I oh, can change deployment there. Better. Dory. Uh, 
for where is he? To oh, both yeah. this. Okay. It seems Okay. Uh first things first. So what should I be doing? Need a hand? Judent. I'm on it. No I've got your back. Judent. It's Bernie's time to shine. Well, I'm gonna help, okay? Oh, if I must. This should be easy if we work together. Okay. Here I go. No, they must You go this way. Right then. That so, way. I will see my duty. There is not a question of can't leave. Rhea and Tala Stand have both drink the monastery. And for the sake of Bodlin's future, we will make it there too. Barriers conjured by the enemy will hinder the movement of our troops. It's fine. Then we've no choice but to proceed in two groups. Take care that neither one is wiped out. Where are the reinforcements? No, I don't want to die. Yeah, done. We should rescue Count Farley if it were possible. It will not be easy to find another man to take him down. There's a structural weakness in that wall. A heavily armored unit might be able to break through and expedite the rescue. Sounds like a perfect job for Edelgard. Smack these it's guys real quick. I know what to do. Get out of your <laughs> A new path has been cleared. Let's take it. They've broken through the walls? No! Send reinforcements at once! Come on. The Southern Church's bishop is an enemy of the goddess and must be destroyed. Now what are they doing? With this daring rescue, your majesty. Grand display of sympathy for my plight. I suspect you abandoned the monastery, just so you might cower here. But I will have your full explanation. Here I go. But I will have your full explanation. They must be once time allowed. Your man. Of course I am. My end would be a crippling blow to the Empire. The man is incorrigible. Someone keep an eye on him. We're not out of the woods yet. The enemy's wretched mage there has conjured barriers that are hampering my escape. That means my ability to fight. He must be a sorcerer of some repute. Let us smite him and his magic here and now. How much kills do I need? 2,000? We've got half an hour time. I'm bringing it down. Keeps Count Varley safe. 
Imperial dogs, stop interfering and learn your place. An ambush? I should have known this would not be as simple as they seemed. I'll follow your lead. <laughs> My turn. I am your man. Ah, there is the perfect place to unleash my secret weapon. Let's fly the arrows. Let's fly the arrows. Where are those coming from? Goodness. Who knew the count still had some fight left in him? I may be a bishop, but I still know when to stay the hand of mercy. Hubert is getting his butt kicked here, by the way. Oh, there's still Falco Knight to life? Falco oh, Knight. Actually, a warp away. Where did he go? We need to dispel those barriers at once. If he retreated to the upper floors, I do not see how we can reach him. There must be some way around the barriers. We received multiple reports of enemy troops appearing out of thin air. Perhaps they have some sort of warping device. Wipe them out! Hubert is getting his butt kicked like always. I have seen such warping devices beneath the monastery. They are controlled by a separate mechanism located elsewhere. Hardly a problem. Then we need to find that too? Oh. We're already into groups. Let's continue the search. Let's do it! Windcaster 3. Thought I sent Edelgard to beat this guy's ass. They must learn who they're up against. Right then. Watch this. My turn. My turn. We'll have these defenses crippled in short order. Of course they are. Letting you 
steal my thunder. <laughs> Found the warp floor. We found the device, but it doesn't seem to operate by itself. Seem to operate by itself. You can't actually go that way. Just keep sending one fucking horseman that way. Or Falcon Knight in this case. Closing in. Well, I'll just have to go intercept them myself. That sounds like fun. are waiting to be until they can move. I guess it's now enough. We got plenty of time. I know what to do. Get out of my way. Yeah, you will. It was my greatest pride to put to be in your sword. With me. I know what to do. Get out of my way. to go, Lady Edelgard. The stronghold is ours. Now there will be no more hurling of the boulders. It's now or never. I know what to do. Get out of my way. I 
will crush all obstacles in my way. I enjoy seeing you at the fore, Edelgard. Would this do? Each time. Okay, let me no attack that one. I'm going to my swap to Hubert. Found the controls. That must be the control device. Try to activate it. I'm bringing it down. Watch this. Time to teleport, boys. Does this mean we can well, walk now? Hurt. Let's use the device to go after that dark mage. There is not a question of can. Only a matter of forward. March! Right then. <laughs> I will see my... Here I go. No mistakes. I'll per... <laughs> Those who slither in the dark did plop plop blue blue. They're really pulling out all the stops here. You better intervene before we take any more casualties. Stop throwing rocks at us! Oh, they shot! Well, that's nice. I'll follow your lead! My son's walls of darkness have disappeared. Now we can rejoin our forces. That dark magic has dissipated. Now I can finally escape. I mean, strategically retreat. <laughs> I'll fight until my dying breath to protect Lady Rhea. I guess you're gonna be dying soon, bro. Ferdinand and fire blazing in your eyes. Long last, kindly spare me the twin jewel speech and allow me to carry out my duty with solemnity. I'll give you ten times the pain you inflicted on Lady Rhea. Out of the way, you'll never reach Lady Rhea. I won't let you. 
You're gonna inflict 10 times the pain I inflicted on Lady Rhea, then I'm just gonna up it by a uh, thousand times. So at the end of the battle. This is the moment we've been fighting for. Rhea and Talus will be waiting just ahead. It's a boon that the Empire's two greatest enemies are both within striking distance, yet we mustn't forget they are capable of anything. This situation could very quickly become dire. Ah, fam. No kidding. We're talking about the heads of the church and those who slither in the dark. I hope you are all mentally prepared. Because once this begins, we cannot afford to waste even a second. Lady Edelgard? We, we await, await your, your command. command. Through some strange twist of fate, we find ourselves capturing Garrick Mok for the second time. Our first victory signaled the start of the war. And today's victory will be a giant step toward ending it. Today, together, we usher in a new era. And at the end of this path lies our future. The time is now. All Imperial forces, advance! Hype. Mission Talus has been defeated. The now all that remains is Ray. She's gonna take her dragon form. Settle things with Rhea here in the cathedral. No matter how many years pass, you people will always be little more than fools. Return the land you stole from us! Sorry, but I think I'd rather fight you instead. I will correct the mistake I made when I took you in by ending your life. The blood of the best ones, and the heart of a traitor. Your sins run deeper than all others. I wear my sins proud, for they are the reason I fight to free Tutlin from the goddess's so called judge. You have left me with no other choice. So be it. I will crush you where you stand! Hold you, she go dragon. Huh. Then you are the immaculate. So be it. 
Today we destroy you and secure our future. Me, uh, blue. No. Thankfully, we have Blue Bird who has dark as well. Technically, his standard em elements also dark. I don't know if this actually works on the arrow damage, though. Surprised she is immune to all Hubert's shit. I'm just gonna swap over to... Edelgard and such because her HP is running low. Oh, oops. I guess it's now or never. Dummy, 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 you. Get out of my way. We will prevail today, even if it costs me the life that Her Majesty so graciously saved. I pray this fight is the one that ends this wretched war for good. Well, I suppose I can allow myself one day of truly giving my all. So, Ferdy, you almost dead, boy. My one more shouldn't that you or not? Grant me power. She's no longer able to maintain that form. If we act quickly, we can restrain her. We must reclaim what was stolen from us. Oh, Bernie. Thalys has reappeared as well. damage. Wouldn't it be funny if Talos now did one big transformation thing? Together, 
back of my mother's fallen comrades. Lonesome helmet. Abominable creatures, I will give you the burial you deserve! <laughs> That's a big boom. It's gonna fall! This way! <sighs> Still no mission complete sign. There's no way. They could have survived that. Well then, just one thing left. Must we do this now? Ugh. But I suppose you earned it. Just this once. At last, Fodlin has been freed from that which bound it. Today marks a momentous new chapter in its history. And we shall be its authors. And we shall be its authors. It is now 1183, Blue Sea Moon. The Empire has freed Garrig Mach and put the Knights of Seros and those who slither in the dark to rout. Amidst the fighting, Archbishop Rhea and Tallis both go missing. With no one to lead, the Central Church's influence wanes and those who slither in the dark vanish. But due to Claude's breaking of a pact to serve his own ambitions, the Empire and Leicester Alliance soon return to war. Bloodshed between the three ruling powers of Fodlan, Empire, Alliance, and the beleaguered kingdom rages on with no end in sight. With no end in sight. Half the Clary? The fuck is that? Don't tell anyone. I focused on <laughs> Yordi again. Arthur Clary. A mighty axe wielded in the War of Heroes by the Imperial Wyvern Corpse. But it's an A rank sword. Nice. Battle data! Prologue, Chapter 1, Chance Encounter. We never did get that S rank there. Most of these are all A's. Because I was playing on hard mode. It wasn't until I said it's easy, or easy, playing on normal already, not that bad. That's where I started getting S ranks. And then some locations, an A. Mostly the end of the bad, uh, the end of the chapter battles, though.
I did end up redoing most of them, though, to get them to S. Paralogues, Rising Darkness... of ambitions 15 chapters Yordi achieved victory and has received a letter from Here Edelgard we stand at long last and with your help we have secured a historic victory but while the war must go on I must tell you something from the very depths of my heart thank you for being a pillar of strength to us all Thank you for carrying us this far. I know I will look to you again in the days to come, for I can no longer imagine an empire without you. <sighs> yeah, yeah, that's it. That's kind of anticlimactic, right? One, we never realize what our power technically is. What uh, Aval, uh, Adol, uh, the guy, why he appeared within us. We fucked up at the moments where we definitely did not need to fuck up. Like, we had to kill Byleth, we had to kill Gerald and uh, Olivia, whatever her name was. Olivia. Uh, yeah. There were a few moments in the game where, like, if I had actually recruited Byleth instead of, uh, uh, killing Gerald, we would probably had a lot of different cutscenes and a lot of different fights. Because most likely, um, the Alliance would not have betrayed us, because Byleth is the one that ended up antagonizing um well you know who to uh, fight us so uh that i'm kind of curious how the game would have ended if we actually had byleth in the party right what cutscenes would have been different um Yeah, that's, that's kind of uh, a few things that I feel kind of bad about. I did save beforehand on a different save file so that we could go back in case we want to do some battles, leveling, whatever. Alright. Get some extra levels in, get some S ranks in the place we didn't have that. Um... So yeah, there's that. Now, gameplay itself. So this is, let's talk about the actual Battlefield gameplay first, because this is where I think that they did a really good job uh, combining both Fire Emblem and Dynasty Warriors. Like using your art, uh, combat arts were only allowed to be done, or well, you can use your combat arts, but that pulls your durability and your weapon just like how that actually works in like Fire Emblem games themselves. At least it worked like that in Three Houses, I don't know what else. Yada yada does it, I only played one, I only played three, two, through Three Houses, and they did a really good job replicating that. The fact that we... Uh, could spring? The fact that we, yes, no, this is, words is hard. The fact that you could like combine two uh, playable characters and main missions to make one unit instead of having eight of which you can control four and the other four are kind of AI. You can still technically control them, send them one way or the other. Uh... Obviously, I didn't do that because I felt the risk was too high of them ending up 
dead. I also found that it was easier to like have them on each other because they would level up together. I, I really like that. Like the awakening point things, the Musu attacks, everything else was just your typical Dynasty Warriors Musu gameplay to me, and that was done really well. Um now camp. Camp was great. Like upgrading everything and talking to everyone and the social points things. I really enjoyed all of that. But <laughs> for a playthrough like this, right? It takes a little too much time. For the amount of battles that there were and the amount of times that you had to like do all of that. I had to do that a total 15 times, remember? There were 15 chapters and I had to do that a total 15 times. Was a little bit too much. Like, don't get me wrong, in the end, that was all my doing because I wanted to talk to them, I wanted to get to know the characters, I wanted to do this and that. But it was a little bit too much. You do get more content out of the game if you do all of that. A little bit too much though, but it does take over well from... It does take over well from... Do we put that? Uh, Fire Emblem, because I had that same issue with Fire Emblem as well. Uh, but in that case, I felt like the talking was way less, at least in the camp itself. And rolling my eyes here real quick. Um shit. Yeah, well the thing there was you could Oh uh, yeah, I remember again. So Fire Emblem Three Houses was completely different game right and at some point you could go into a battle select screen and once you go into that screen you can battle and then if you leave that screen you go to the next day or you can choose another battle that way that's the way how i decided to level back then and also level up everyone's class that they were playing but also all the friendship points, right? Just by repeating battles so many times and getting everyone leveled up and name it. But you couldn't increase past... So if you were at C rank and you max out C rank, you first have to go watch the video of C rank, the conversation of the C rank, then go back and level up from C to max B. That, that was the only difference from this game and the previous one. In this game, you did not have to do the talky talk to increase the social points. Okay, that was, that was everything that I kind of wanted to say about what I thought of the game. The game is great. I really enjoyed it. It was a good game. It still is a good game. Technically, I should be playing through it, I think. Two more times, I don't know if there is a choice of going uh, with Rhea's path. I'm pretty sure that Three Houses has the Rhea path. Even though I've never actually tried that. <clears throat> uh, so yeah, great game. Gameplay, awesome. Better to play off stream and when you don't feel like... Um, you have like you're sort of on the time limit but yeah that's that so we can unlockable units have been added to the save data's reound exchange new equipment has been added to the save data reound exchange new crest items have been added to the save data's reound exchange the vanguard whistle has been added to the save data's reound exchange use it instantly to capture a region You have unlocked maddening difficulty, Nani, carrying over clear data. 
When starting a new game, you can carry over content from the save data of the finished playthrough, if one exists. You can choose whether to import a unit's level on a per-unit basis. Sport levels can only be imported as a batch for all units, excluding Merc Whistle. Other data, such as item, gold, and class level, will be imported automatically. If you select the finished playthrough using the continue option, you will start just before the final battle. Huh. Okay, so I don't need this safe anymore. That is interesting. So what, um... Voice lines... Continue. Clear data. Oh, that's kind of fire, I'm not gonna lie. Per unit, though, so I can, if I want to, grab Yordi and then... Uh, well, I guess we'll have to go and test that. Do I really want to do that right now, though? I would probably be best for me to, like, start up an entire new save file, if that's the case. Lindhart and Burn and Detta have another conversation with each other. Uh, just for funsies, let's go have a look at that, right? Bernadetta? What are you doing here? Uh-oh. Looks like I'm interrupting. I'll be going. Lindhart! Listen to me! <laughs> The two people we saw out on a date here. Well, the guy died. Sadly, that sort of thing does happen. Another tragic love story for the books, I suppose. I really believed they'd live happily ever after, and I can't take an ending like this. We're it's burning. so awful. Perhaps so, but this is the result of the Empire choosing war. But I thought the power of their love for each other would see them through, safe and sound. You expect too much from love. <laughs> Rude, Lindhart. Instances where emotion allows the body to go beyond the bounds of what should be possible. But the effects are quite minor. It's certainly not going to bring the dead back to life. Well, I know that, Lindhart. I just think it's sad. You're so rough. Don't you think it's sad? <laughs> if push, don't yes, you think it's sad? To be sad? What is wrong with you? I didn't even know the man's name. Also, plenty of our enemies died. I didn't even so know the man's name. For allies. <laughs> because they're, you know, our allies. I wouldn't want you to die, of course. That would make me quite sad. And I don't want to see you die either, Linhart. I'd cry even more if you died. Just the thought of it makes me... Makes me? Makes me... <laughs> Do you cry like that, SQ? <laughs> oh dear. Please don't cry over things that haven't happened yet. Oh no. That's what I'm doing. I'm so sorry, Linhart. It's fine, but to that point, let's just make sure you and I both survive this war together. If we can do that, what you said will have come true and I'll happily apologize. Um, apologize? For what? <laughs> yes, she says. I still need to do that one minute of relaxation uh, exercise. Overcome the risk of death. I'll do that right now, actually. After all, the two of us surviving the war would refute any arguments I've made to the contrary. Oh, I get it. So you and me and the power of our feelings for each other could... Uh, wait, are... what now? All of this earnest conversation has me exhausted. Time for some sleep. <sighs> on me now if you do that i'm leaving you here
What a rest. Hmm? What's going on there? Is... is this really happening? Oh, my prayers have been answered! When I was about to die, your face floated into my mind, and then a miracle happened. It seems reports of his death in battle were greatly exaggerated. I'll have to let Bernadetta know. Although, given her sensibility, she's as likely to think he's a ghost as she is to be happy about it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so funny. An award is available. What is my awards? An energy drop. Any results a good result. Few documents. I don't really feel like to watch reading all this. Okay, so we can purchase items, which is, I don't know what. A whistle that signals your army to advance can be used to instantly capture unclaimed regions. So what, is that for, uh, next game? Next playthrough? I think it is. Purchase equipment. Dark Creator Swords. This one has a crest, this one doesn't. Sick. Anthem? Crafted with archaic method, this sword is Korya's weapon of choice. Riddle, Thalus sword. Arcepelius. Cronelia's preferred. Wait, Cronelia? Experience gem gives extra XP. Knowledge gem accelerates class growth. Crest accessory grants the crest of earnest to the processor. The shit? Crest accessories are special type of accessories that will grant you the associated crest power when equipped them. However, crests granted by an accessory do not trigger off as often as normal crests. If a unit equipped a crest accessory for a crest they already have, then that trigger rate will increase. Sick! Oh, that's fucking fire! This is probably the sword for uh, my guy, right? Also, this would be super sick to have. We already have one experience gem, but to gain extra levels. Unlock units. Completed the game, Sothis. Wait, I get Sothis and Rhea. Complete the game with the Ashen Demon as an ally. Okay, so for this playthrough, I cannot get Byleth. Who unlocks... is this... does this unlock Aloise? That's actually... I expected more characters to be able to be unlocked. Hmm. But why would we get these if... We're not gonna get... Dark Dragon Sign, Crest of Timotheus, Chevalier, Sharon, Abin, Chittel, Chanel, Nao, Serons, Makul, Ernest. Does that mean I unlock more if we. Oh. This makes my head hurt.
I do think, though, that if I... Would that be the case? Everything I'll gets ported over according bells. to... Hey there! Need something? Awful error. This one probably works very well on thingy. Make Mercurius Atharia. Is this it? 6k? Is this I don't it? have that much money. Elector 3. Alt the Claire. Just the X we just got, right? Brave Bow. Is this it? Holy shit, this one is strong. Let me see, this is half the Claire, yeah. Let me just get rid of these, I don't need these. Scythosarium, keep that one. This Silver X can go, this Devil X can go. We keep these. Our Knuckle can go. It's an A rank Knuckle. Get our Thelm. Abyssal Thelm. Repair weapons. Reforge. See you around. Okay, let me have a look. We did get that sword just now. How strong is that sword? Mercurius. It's actually kind of weak. War of the Eagle and the Lion. The Sword of Zolthan is an A rank as well. Now that I look at it. Um, is there anything else? Interesting. Well, hello there. I can buy these things. Come uh, back soon. Important. How about you? you buy items. Fenora. All kinds of food. And sealed gifts. I wonder sh if I should max out on these. Hope to see you again soon. Good day to you. I wonder if I can. Probably not, right? Work you into shape. Three cover. Those kind of points. <clears throat> Which battlefield are you headed to? Let me see. The only thing that I. Oh, wait, we did. Oh, it does look completed. That's interesting. Capture without fighting? Oh, <laughs> you cannot you. Oh, oh, that would allow you to speed through the other campaigns. Make sure you're ready. Catch, you already catch. I caught it. Oh, <sighs> okay. Um.
That is interesting. I don't know how I'm gonna continue with this game yet. If I'm completely honest, right? On one side, I just want to go right into the next... Next campaign. But on the other side, I kind of want to max out on everything and everyone in here first. Which should technically not be that hard to do. We still have a lot of battles left to do in the record to section. We haven't even completed... This This looks funny because we put maddening. Wait, what? Level th enemy level 3? Oh, here. Look. It will give me better loot. I'll continue gathering records. Um... I also don't really know how I'm gonna upload this to YouTube yet. Currently, I'm thinking of... uploading it in chapters... per... House that we're playing as, right? By the looks of it. Uh, I also don't know. I mean, I could. Nah. Let me have a look at all the support info right now. On Yordi, we're getting very close on getting everyone finished. That we have currently, right? It's also fairly easy to get this done. But do I want to do the same thing with every character? That every character is befriended with every character. And to that, I think I'd say no, right? If. Because technically speaking, it's, that is fairly easy if I go into battles. And I just adjudant them to each other. The way that I make friends with them is just gonna be like, yo, I have a shit ton of gifts, and we're just gonna gift everyone whatever the fuck they want. Right? Hoo-hoo! <laughs> Complete 50 different quests on maddening difficulty. Under enemy general rules while on disadvantage. Maximum advantage. Um So I'm really kind of thinking to myself, how are we going to do this? Because I like the game, and we still have plenty of time before Digimon Survive actually comes out. Hmm... Tomorrow I'm not here anyways. Uh, I think I'm gonna do most of this off-stream. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna record it. I just don't feel like it. Maybe I'll record, like, the sep... Mm. I don't know yet. Maybe I'll just save everything up. Like, I'm not gonna do for everyone, right? Not every- everyone. Most- I think I'm only gonna, like, complete everything on Yordi. Do the chats with everyone. Because that brings out the most information anyways. <sighs> Doing everyone to at least rank C with everyone is just gonna be a pain in the butt, isn't it? 
I don't know if there's anyone out there that would go that far. Let me have a look at all the achievements again. Battle prep, equipment, war map, story. Mm, growth. Ability hunter, raise a class level and attain 100 unique abilities. Enlighten one master, max out the unit's level in enlightened... In the enlightened one class. Grimmery master. That. It's not what I care about though, battle prep. It's already completed. So for whole lake. Jesus, 300k while shopping. Grow stronger at the tactics academy 250 times. Cooked 750 times. These are all things that I can only do later on, most likely. Diligent trainee, train at the training grounds 100 times. Went on expeditions uh, 25 times. Smooth talker, got a perfect conversation score on an expedition 10 times. Unselfish volunteer. Hire 50, diff 50 different battalions. Expert food maker. Gave 10 gifts. At least these are already done. Yeah, I really don't know how to proceed with this. Completely, at least. Let me look at all the new things we have. Come back soon, all right? Um. Black Eagle. A rank. A rank. A rank. A rank. Dorothea, B rank goes away, C rank goes away, C rank goes away, C rank goes away, B rank goes away, B rank goes away, B rank goes away, B rank, B rank, C rank, B rank. Reaper Knights. Okay. Well, well. Hello, you. Can I actually get rid of these? This one sucks. This one, even though it's a C rank, has resist level swords, level 7. That is fucking bonkers. My A ranks don't even have that much. Like, these can go, these suck. This one sucks as well. The other ones are definitely high level. Higher. At least not for now, we're not gonna hire. Come back soon, alright? Uh I'm brainstorming too much. I think I'll Yeah, we're not gonna do that right now though, because it's getting late. I think what I'm gonna do, this is purely for my funsies.
Time to work you into shape. Choir classes. Wait, did I? Oh yeah, I did. Never mind. Grabbing Yordi. Uh, yeah, sure, unlock this one. Uh, nope, not yet. We're just gonna unlock them real quick. Another tool in the belt. <laughs> Looks hilarious. Yeah, okay, so this is what I want to do. I want to make sure that I stack up on items. Right? Uh, that I gain a little bit of money. My instruction comes Come back soon, okay? Price. Don't tell me what to do, woman. <laughs> Wait, what the hell? Um, yeah, okay. So what I want to do is max out every character here in this situation. Don't neglect your days. Make a decent amount of money. That's number two. Uh, make sure. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. That we have resources. It's, for all I care, it could be a shit ton of these things that I need there, so that I can get rid of everything that is not necessary. Oh, I could upgrade this one and. I could have a lot of might on it. it. Does look nicer. I think I'll keep this one for the time being. Invert offense defense. What the fuck does that do? Swaps the unit strength and defense and also Magum. Mm, never mind. We're gonna kick this guy into the fucking Himalayas. Go away. This one is actually going to go on someone. This one is going away. Patria, on the other hand, is going to go on Bernadette. Sure, we'll keep you because you're that, and we'll keep you because you're that. Uh, give that sword to uh, someone else, actually. And I will, I'll come on a different time. Oh. Everything has its use. I know this experience gem is currently on. You Imperial Poet of Arms Pen, a quality written instrument adorned with two-headed eagle given and to encourage letter writing while away from the Imperial Capital. The fuck is that? Oh, wait, that's the thing, uh, yeah, that's uh, Edelgard's thingy that she gave us. Okay, so that for more experience points. Of any army. What was I talking about again? Oh yeah. So yeah, I am gonna make sure that I have enough resource of everything by doing everything battles and talking use. to her and getting a shit ton of everything so that we can upgrade most things as quickly as possible in the next battle section, in the next chapter. 
then I want to make sure that we have enough master seals, enough advanced seals, and enough in intermediate seals so that we can just buy them off easily and just level up when necessary. Interesting. Uh, she sells them infinitely, which is also very nice. Uh, and in the meantime, I'm just going to level Yordi up, because he's going to be coming over anyways. And the characters that I know that are going to be in the next route that we're going to be playing are going to be level... My nephew talks so much, I got a headache and I'm tired now. Aww. But yes, at least to make sure that most of those characters are fully prepared for the next step. Like, make sure that there are good weapons for them. Uh, that there are... All sorts of things. So that I have to waste less money and time on getting the other ones leveled up. At a high price. I think that's a good way to go forward. But yeah, other than that... Don't neglect just level up Yordi as much as possible. I think that's our next goal... ...for a while, and I don't think I'm gonna record those sessions. Oh yeah, before anything else, actually. Let's go to Journal. Spend Renown. Rion, whatever. Uh, sure, we'll... Oh no, actually, we'll wait with looking those guys, because they're hard to... They have a shit ton of shit. Let's just put it like that. Uh, we want three of you... Three of you, we want this one. This one, this one, and this one. I honestly don't really know why I'm taking these. Calculates damage using the unit's magic stat. Critical damage boost. Okay, so you guys purchase items here. We want the Vanguard Whistle. Oh, I can buy as much as I want. It's not really necessary, though. Um, buy all of these, or as much. I don't really feel the need to buy these, to be completely honest. The units will come later as well. So if I'm correct, this one should work well on my boy here, right? Mm, I think we're actually going to start off with Knowledge Gem on... Because I'm going to change class. So that we can uh, fuck around with some other classes. Uh, we want to go to the blacksmith. Hey there, need something? Leash facts, twin crest. Also attack to hit twice. Sick. Dark creator sword. Is this it? Yeah, and more Umbra Steel and such could not be a bad thing to have. See you around. Okay, so Convoy Yordi. Change class.
Should we start a mortal servant? Yeah, let's just start on the mortal servant. Uh, the rest is still pretty fine. Level all of that up. Um, I do need to figure out, like, I can probably just throw in some other characters here now and then if I'm gonna use them. We need to start on some. Um, yeah, I need to start on some lower missions, anyways, of which we do not have S ranks. And I'll just swap in some other characters to be hugging with each other while I run around with Yordi and try to... Oh, we don't want to do maddening yet. Maddening is... Maddening. Mm, I could set them to hard, though. But I think we're just going to stick with normal for the time being. As I'm not necessarily leveling for... Oh, so that's why I haven't done these on S on normal rank yet. Uh, normal difficulty. Is that why they are like that? Maiden's Peril. This one I wasn't fast enough for. Well, we'll see. Like, I will see tomorrow when I actually go and do some things. Same here. They're like... Three we haven't done on S rank, and then this one. This one is a question mark, question mark, which means that we didn't complete the necessary things. Actually, look this, right? Clash of ambitions. Would that mean I need to start over again? Is that a thing? Paralogue, uh, only this one. Uh, these are the Paralogues, I remember again. These are also forced with specific characters, I think. Maybe not in this section. Yeah, I, I'll figure it out. If it's actually that we have to run through the... through Edelgard's campaign again because I didn't get Byleth. And... That makes me miss out on a specific mission, That because that will make me cry, in all honesty. I need this one unlocked. So if there is a chance that that is the case, then we're most likely going to do that before we're starting another campaign of anyone else. I will, I'll obviously, make battles. sure that everything is as hanky-dory as possible. Okay, I think uh, that's everything. What was there in bonuses again? I don't have amiibos. A fire em, at least. So yeah, ladies and gents, gents and gentle ladies, thank you very much for hanging out with me tonight. That is the end of the Edelgard story. Like I said before, we're most likely not going to be um, recording the next few sessions of this game. I don't know how long it's going to take me until I actually start the next campaign. By the time I might actually have uploaded all pieces onto YouTube and YouTube will be wondering where are the other stories? And the answer to the question is I'm still working on them. I still have not made a freaking art piece uh, for this series yet, which means something, 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 something. <clears throat> that at least uh, at least I have an idea of what I'm gonna do now f since I do think I'm gonna play through every story maybe we'll see so uh, we're most likely going to represent a uh, thing with each of the classes houses dark colors in this case red for Edelgard uh, yellow for Claude, and 
Blue for Dimitri. Uh, yeah, depending on my motivation, that is. We might, uh, I might, I might make good pieces on that. I haven't had any drawing motivation lately, it's really kicking my ass. I still have, like, I have one animation that I want to work on, but haven't been planning it out well enough. Uh, you were gonna leave without me. I didn't know you were gone, SQ. Uh, I have a drawing of Aqua that I want to finish. I have a drawing of Kill that I want to start on and finish. I haven't been feeling it at all. It's super frustrating. So, um, yeah, we'll see how I'm going to do that. But uh, I'd like to thank you all very much for hanging out with me. And uh, until next time, good night, adios, and sleep well. Sweet dreams.